Good morning. This is Mrs. Serio, and welcome to BTV Morning Announcements Home Edition. Today is Friday, April 17th, 2020, also known as Fun Friday. The weather today in Myerstown is cool and cloudy with a chance of rain in the afternoon with a high of 50 degrees and a real feel of 46 degrees. Special activities. Here are some special activities that all took place on this day, April 17th, in history. In the year 1387, according to scholars, this is the day that Geoffrey Chaucer's Canterbury Tales characters began their pilgrimage to Canterbury. And in the year 1817, the first United States School for the Deaf opens in Hartford, Connecticut. Fun activity ideas while social distancing. I know that social distancing can be very tough. We all miss being around the people we know and love. However, keep hanging in there and remember that this is the best way for us all to make sure we stay safe and healthy. Also keep in mind that even though we can't control our current situation, we can control how we react to it by choosing to either be positive or negative. We can choose to find fun no matter what we're faced with. That's what I'm bringing to you today. Check out these 15 fun ideas on how you can keep busy during social distancing. Number one, make photo albums. Two, have a yes day. Three, visit the virtual zoo. Four, camp out in the living room. Five, put on a play or recital. Maybe even whip out those recorders you got in music class and give your family a show. Six, go on a scavenger hunt. Seven, pretend to travel to another country. Eight, have a pizza contest. Not sure what that is, but anything that has to do with pizza is obviously going to be amazing. Nine, make sensory dough. Ten, write letters. And no, texting doesn't count. Eleven, get outside. I know Ms. Slabonic is a huge fan of that one. Twelve, have a backwards day. Thirteen, do some spring cleaning. 14, make tie-dye shirts. 15, have a Disney day. Special guest appearance, Mrs. Gantz. Here with a very special message to all of you is our very own third grade teacher, Mrs. Gantz. Check it out. Hey, Elko IS family, Mrs. Gantz here. I am here for you today for Fun Friday and we will be enjoying Vocabulary Fun Friday. Did you know that Earth Day is this coming Wednesday, April 22nd? Well, if you didn't know, now you know. So we will watch a vocabulary video today on Earth Day. Enjoy. Earth Day's coming up. It is? And I think for this Earth Day, I want to show you guys how it started. That sounds cool. So let's hop in my time machine and go back. Let's go. Travel back in time to 1970. Nobody cares about the Earth crazily. We haven't ever cared because we don't understand it. We don't even know that humans can hurt the planet. We don't have rules to prevent pollution when factories make waste. What's the solution? What do do? Dump it in the water, uh -huh. release it in the air, pay no mind to that oil spill over there. Cool. Recycle it? That's not something we do, because we don't know that there's any reason to. But all last year, Mr. Nelson was scheming, he was senator from the state of Wisconsin. He's frustrated, because people don't seem to care what happens to the oceans, soil, and air. So the senator finds students who are passionate about making change. They are activists, and they help organize the first Earth Day. They chose April 22nd as the date, yeah. so that it's nice out. Warm spring weather for people to appreciate the Earth together. Uh, Earth Day, hey, we're celebrating the Earth today. Earth Day, hey, we want to protect the planet each and every day. Earth Day, hey, we're celebrating the Earth today. Earth Day, hey, we want to protect the planet each and every day. Yep. Earth Day was a great success. Earth Day had a lasting effect. After Earth Day, the Clean Air Act was born. So when you inhale and exhale, the air won't harm. The Endangered Species Act was also born. If there's a threat to animals, sound the alarm. And the Water Quality Improvement Act reduced water pollution. That's a fact. Plus, 
earth they inspired unmistakably. The Environmental Protection Agency, Senator Nelson didn't stop there. He worked to have Earth Day every year, everywhere, yeah. to educate people about the Earth's well-being, because environmentalism was a cause he believed in. And now, thanks to Senator Nelson's labor, Earth Day still popping decades later. Over a billion people participate every year across the globe and all the way back here. We show our support for planet Earth and protecting it because we know it's worth. Uh, Earth Day, yeah. hey, we celebrate in the Earth today. Earth Day, hey, we want to protect the planet each and every day. Earth Day, hey, we celebrate in the Earth today. Earth Day, hey, we want to protect the planet each and every day. I hope you enjoyed that video about Earth Day. And I hope you're able to get outside this weekend and enjoy the nice weather, hopefully, that we will have and enjoy the earth. Thanks, everyone. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Bye. Have a tremendous weekend. And remember to always be respectful, responsible, and ready. Clean TV, new studio, please.